Ukraine has entered a trade agreement with the EU, the very deal that started events that saw the previous administration toppled and ultimately led to the ongoing bloody standoff in the country's east. President Petro Poroshenko signed the association pact in Brussels and says that he believes this is the way to carry out the will of the nation. The people demanding European future, very clear, every single region of Ukraine support one candidate, demonstrating we are ready for reform, we are ready for Europe, we are ready for peace. But in eastern Ukraine, there appears to be little support for Kiev. The self-proclaimed republics of Donetsk and Lugansk, with a population of more than six million, are refusing to recognize the new leaders and are openly critical of their European ambitions. More than 350 people have been killed, 257 of them civilians, since Kiev launched its military operation against the defiant eastern regions. But President Poroshenko is determined to set course for Europe. So let's see why aligning with the EU appears uh, so attractive for Kiev and where the possible catches could lie. Well, the deal will remove tariffs on almost all goods traded between Ukraine and Europe. That is, of course, if it meets EU standards, which it doesn't at the moment, and will have to spend about $100 billion in order to do so. Winning a place at the European table, Ukraine will no longer be Russia's preferential partner and will lose $500 billion in trade. Global financial markets expert Patrick Young believes the association deal with the EU is a grave mistake. Ukraine, which last year was in a catastrophic position, had it signed a free trade association. This year is going to associate with the European Union at the point when it's on the brink already of economic disaster. This is a catastrophic move for the Ukrainian economy. The only winners out of this are a few sadly deluded egos, whether they're in Brussels, whether they're in Washington, who believe somehow or other they've achieved a great geopolitical victory. For the people of Ukraine, there there are no jobs to be had here. There's only going to be job losses. There is no economic growth to be had by suddenly having Western European goods dumped at low cost onto your marketplace. This deal is a disaster. It's a very, very tragic day for the people of Ukraine who want to improve their economic outlook. Well, those in Ukraine supporting the association agreement with the EU have high hopes for the deal. But not everything pro-European Ukrainians are hoping for is on the table right now. Although Brussels promises Ukraine to establish visa-free travel, that's uh, not actually mentioned in the association agreement. The freedom of employment within the EU is only for member states, and there is no actual guarantee of eventual EU membership.